Freeze, bitch. Don't move. Yeah, don't move. So basically, this is going to be a quick video. This is called the magic mirror. The shit that can make your dreams a reality. See, first things first. People, places, and things, circumstances, and situations can always block you in life. Which means you don't have self-reflection. You don't know who you are. You don't have no idea, no concept of what's going on inside you turn eternity. So this basically means that you have put yourself out there and lost yourself. AKA, you need to spend time with yourself. Love yourself. Look in the mirror. Talk to yourself. Have an internal perspective, an internal communication, an internal relationship with yourself. And this is called caring. Now, the moon is in Cancer. Now, I'm going to do that tarot card reading. Of course, I'm going to get back to everybody's readings. I ain't forget y'all. I love y'all. But this, this video right here is predicated towards the I care energies. So whatever you're caring for, whatever you're trying to do, care for this mirror. Talk to this mirror. This could be predicated towards the moon and cancer energies that you're basically trying to reciprocate back into your life. So by utilizing this ritual and spell, you look in the mirror, you talk to yourself. No matter, it can be 5 minutes, 10 minutes, 30, 30 minutes. Make this an everyday process. And of course, use this because you know mirrors is portals. So remember when you're dissecting and basically putting yourself in that portal, these are the frequencies and vibrations that's basically being created within that portal. And of course, what goes in must come out. So what you're putting in that mirror is going to be a self-reflection. So make sure you're in good energies and good vibes when you're doing this. So this is better gonna this is gonna better help you to know who you are when you go to sleep, when you go to your dreams. Because you may not know what's going on in your dreams. There can be a whole lot of shit going on in your dreams. And of course Everything that's going on in your dreams is about you. So utilizing this mirror can help you better control your dreams to make your dreams a reality. And of course, put you into a situation and a frequency to bring your dreams down on heaven. This way, your dreams won't be all over the place. You won't be jumping from here to here. You're, you're going to dream. Your spirit always going to tell you what's going on in your dreams. And of course, how you're feeling is basically the true perspective on how your state is going to basically play out to this whole totality. Now, look into this, look into this mirror. Talk into this mirror. First thing you first thing you do, you either meditate or you look in the mirror. If you don't got time to, to meditate, you look in the mirror. It's the first thing you do. Do not go outside. Else, do not go out there because you're gonna get outmatched and outweighed by the outside world. You're gonna be thinking your thoughts as you. You're gonna be thinking your feelings as you. You're gonna be thinking your emotions and your energies as you. That's truly not true. Before you go outside, you look in that mirror. You get yourself right. This way, when you go outside. <coughs> You know what you're doing, you know who you are, and you're not getting lost into none of this witchcraft or air that you're breathing to basically dissect you and dilute you. This is the ritual spell that you need to focus on and predicate and be loyal to this shit. Part two coming though.